how <laughs> fabulous is that? Now, I'm lucky enough to have actually once met Ivana Trump. I had lunch with her about 25 years ago. She is frightening in the flesh. <laughs> All the people that think I'm frightening, try. What is it, the Wait. Botox that's frightening? No, she's just very weird. She had on a very, very tight corset. Yeah. And the only thing I can tell you that's um, uh, the only chink in her armour is she took her very tight jacket off and she had a kind of cocktail frock on. And when I went to the loo, I saw she had those rolls of flab. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they were all being shunted to the back. She was, she was one of the first guests. She speaks guests. really well of you. Yeah. <laughs> she, was, she was one of the first guests, actually, on Loose Women. And I was really new to presenting. I'd been an actress and I was yeah. making mistakes constantly. And I just didn't know what to say. And she said, hello, I'm Ivana. And she held my hand. And I said, oh, sorry, I wish I'd had a shower. <laughs> I said that out loud on live television. But she makes you feel sort of unclean. I know, but if you, if you work it through, I mean, this is going to be the biggest meow in America. This is going to yeah. go on and on for weeks. Yeah, yeah. Um, but if you think about Ivana's situation, she gave birth to those children who are well ensconced in the White House running America alongside Donald. Mm. Um, and her grandchildren live there as well. So I'm thinking to myself, as a grandmother, if that was me, I think I'd want into the White House. I'd be saying, I've got to go and visit my grandchildren this afternoon. Yeah, so there's yeah. a little element of a, a very strange yeah. scenario that she finds herself in. So you're quite sympathetic. No, not really. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking that if my children were there, I probably would want to... I would think, well, they're my children, my grandchildren. 